Hey there, welcome back to my channel. Okay, so today we are going to play with some more She Modern products. Uh, this time we are going green. So I'm going to use um, the neon green, and this one is the sparkling, and this is the sheer color, and then this is the neon green, and it is the sheer as well, but it is just um, regular, like there's no shimmer. So there, you can see the, the difference. Um, now, I just found out, I've got the first versions of these new powders. Um, so all the, the sparkling and the hollow ones, they all come with a black cap and the regular ones come with a white cap. Um, so if you order them now, if you order like the sparkling, you'll have a black cap. So um, just so people can tell the difference. So that is a great idea. So anyway, so I just thought I'd point that out in case you're kind of wondering um, when if you order and you get a, one with black cap and one with white so you know what's going on. And then these are um these are the glitter colors um in spark so this one's i think one's hollow just going by the blue because unfortunately mine didn't come with labels mine got missed um so yeah not not a big deal i'm, I'm gonna label them myself so one is hollow and um, one is, see, like, like the, the blue ones, right? So one is regular glitter, and then this one is the hollow glitter. So I have the same version in the blue, but just in green. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm actually... I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to do all four. I'll do four nails. And um, then I'm just gonna do a little design on, on the end and then that way you can see. So on my nails, don't mind, they're a little stained. Um, I used a red polish uh, by Co Color Club and it kind of stained my nails a little bit pink. And of course they're yellow cause I, you know, I paint my nails all the time. So yeah, it happens, so okay. So I'm just gonna dispense, um, this is one of the, um, the palettes uh, that she has. So this one, the first one, um, I'm just gonna do it off camera. That way you don't have to sit here and listen to me tap, tap. But anyway, this is what I do. I just dispense it like this. So I will be right back, one moment. Okay, so I'm back and I've got everything out. Um, just a note. Um, when you're doing the regular powders, you got to tap, 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 um, and then they come out with the glitters. <laughs> as you can see, um, they come out faster. So just be aware to be a little more um, careful with them so you don't dispense too much. I don't know, I guess with the glitters, it makes them slipperier, and so they don't, they, they come out <laughs> of the dispenser really quickly. Okay. So, um, on my nails, um, I've got my peel off base coat, my UNT, and um, I also have um, the glue gel, which is for dry color, um, coloring glitter and pigments. And I've already cured that. So now I'm gonna use my little um, brush. That I use. Um, my friend um, Karina from Karina Nail Designs, she sent me a link for it um, on AliExpress. I didn't buy it from the store she recommended because I wanted to charge like five bucks for for shipping. But I found another one, so I've I've ordered like, I don't know, three? <laughs> um, like I ordered the one with wooden handles and then I ordered a couple pretty ones, so They'll be coming in the mail soon, but uh, thank you, for Karina, for sending me the link to that. That was very nice of you. So, okay, 
uh, where is my nail pal? This is my nail pal, and it is from the nail prop shop. I'm just gonna take the glitters and move them over so I don't <laughs> don't mess them up. I like using the nail pal when I'm doing my my other hand. That way, um, I don't um, it don't wobble, and it keeps me in frame for you guys. So. Okay, so first one is the neon green, and this is the sparkling one. And oh, I don't know if you guys can see the sparkle, but it's so pretty, pretty, pretty. Gorgeous. So there, there it is. Okay. Oh, I forgot my piece of paper towel. My itty bitty piece of paper towel. So I'm just going to rub that brush on the paper towel. And now we're going on to the neon green, the regular. The non sparkly. This is a pretty green. Like, I'm not a huge green fan. Like, to be honest, like, greens, I mean, they're fine for flowers and trees and you know plants and stuff but on my nails not so much the only time I really use green is at Christmas I think or if I have a nail challenge or whatever the green is, is is not a color I like I don't know what's your yucky colors like do you guys have yucky colors I'm not I don't do a lot of browns and I don't do a yellow a lot of yellows because I guess with my skin tone with yellows, it just makes me look more yellow. So, anyway. So, do you guys have yucky colors that you just won't, you won't wear? I mean, I'll wear them, but, you know. I just prefer not to. But these are actually pretty. Like the neon ones, they're actually really pretty. I like them a lot. Gorgeous. Look at those. Okay, wipe the brush off. I should have put a little thing underneath my my nail pal. I'm actually getting glitter everywhere. Oh well. I wipe it up. My my uh, floor under uh, my nail desk. <laughs> it's like glittery. It's glittery and blingy. My husband will sometimes hand me a bling or something and he's like, I think this is yours. Because he, you know, finds it in the house. Okay, these glitter ones, oh, 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 they're gorgeous. I think I missed a spot on the side of the nail here. Okay, look at these. Gorgeous. Okay, so we want to put a second coat on yeah what the heck so I'm just gonna grab some more of the glue gel what I need to do though let's get my brush and I just want to kind of brush off the excess okay hang on I'll be right back okay so I cleaned it off and then I put another coat of the glue gel on and I cured that so now we're just gonna go in and put a second coat I'm making this a little more opaque I mean you can always put uh, a layer of color down um, and then um, then do the pigments I just did the bare nails because I wanted you to you guys to see um, 
what they they look like in their true form I mean I guess it's kind of hard to tell when when I got yellow and pink na kind of nails but you know it gives you an idea the color is not um, changed that much but oh these are gorgeous I'm kind of kind of digging the, the sparkle ones but I'm really liking the plain ones too it's a beautiful green I like the neon the neon greens are just gorgeous probably have way too much on here that I dispensed out but oh, look have a bit of a mess to clean up. Do, do, do. Yeah, so what I did with to just clean off, I just used a little fluffy brush that I have and just kind of cleaned up the nails and a little bit of extra glitter that was left on the nails. That way it didn't contaminate my bottle. And then I brushed it off as I was doing it. So look at those. Gorgeous. Okay, so I'm gonna top coat these and then I will come back. I'm gonna clean up my, my mess I made because ta-da, I made a mess. Um, and then we're gonna do a little bit of nail art. Okay, so hang on one sec. Okay, so I'm back. And um, here we are. I cleaned it off with some alcohol, so my, my nails are a little dry, or my hands are a little dry. Okay, so first color is the sparkling. And the second color is just the neon green, the sheer. And I just noticed that on the tip of my nail, I have some leftover nail polish, so yeah, I'm sorry. And then this is this one. I'm thinking it might be the hollow. Because look at that. Look at that. And then this one is the regular glitter. So yeah. Aren't they gorgeous? Okay, so I am going to um, be right back. I am just going to um, clean up. Or I did clean up, but take some pictures so I have some pictures before nail art and I will be right back and we're gonna do some nail art okay one sec hey there okay so we're back and um, I cut out my little um, Christmas ornaments and I have them on a um, mixing canvas and now I've got just this little water um, bottle. I use it for water. Um, we used to get these all the time when, when she mo modern first started. It's got this little no nozzle. So what I do, this is the way I do my, my water decals. I just put them on my mixing canvas and then I skirt water onto it and um, let them sit. I just find this way easier and that they don't float around. I don't have to fish them out of a bowl. So these are uh, the She Modern um, water decals, the foil ones. And I got the, the red glitter and the silver glitter. And um, so I just pre-cut them. It was way easier to do. And they are gorgeous. So now what I'm going to use is the actual grip gel so this will um, adhere the water decal to my nails okay uh, I was gonna say where did I put my nail pal um, move the, these guys out of the way so I'm just gonna and this one has the green dot on it so I'm just gonna and I got way too much on the brush so I got four, so I'm going to do four. So put these all on the nail. 
needles and then I'm going to cure it. Okay, so I will be right back. Okay, so I'm all cured. So now I've got, um, this is my stamper. I've delegated it to glitter and I use it for my water decals as well. Um, so I just pick it up. All I do, I guess I'll show you for the next one. So, and then I just take a piece of paper towel, blot it off. And then see, you can tell that I've, I've put it in acetone, so that's why it's delegated to um, glitters. And um, and there we go. So, oh, I forgot to mention, if you have water decals that, um, like these ones that, that have the bigger um, water decal, I cut little slits into them because I have really curvy nails so they don't always um, lay flat and I find if I do do that then it'll lay flat for me. Okay so what I do is I just grab it, plunk it onto the water deco and then blot it off. So it picks it up, it's awesome. So kind of faced that one in so I'm going to face this one this way oh it's a little pushed over to the side a bit Let's see if I can see and I can still move it a little bit so I kind of moved it over and I move it down So now I'll do a little red guy. So I, I think I think for for doing water decals, I think I'll, I'm going to find another one where it's easier to see. There's that one, and last one. Oops. <laughs> Oopsie. But they're easy to place. And then what I do is I'll just kind of rock it back and forth and it pushes it down if I need to. Or you can also use a silicone tool. And then I just get my paper towel and then wipes up the water and um, voila. Okay, aren't they cute? So you could totally color these um, these Christmas ornaments in if you want, but um, I kind of like having the glitter poke through. Okay, so I'm just gonna grab my I May Lee top coat and top coat, and I'll be right back for a moment. Okay, so I'm back and. There are my Christmas ornaments. I think they turned out super cute. Like, I really like the red. The red one. I mean, the hollow is nice too, but the red is just super striking. And there's that one on the glitter. And that one. I think it turns out pretty. I like these little ornaments. They're super cute. Okay, so that is my video for today. I want to thank you for coming and hanging out with me while I did some swatching and did a little bit of nail art. Um, so the next ones I'm going to swatch uh, for you are, uh, I was requested the yellow. So I have the yellow pigment powders and um, I have the glow in the dark ones. So I'll probably do these three next so and then after that I have the pink and the purples so anyway thank you for hanging out with me and I hope you're having an awesome day or evening or whatever it is wherever you are okay love you guys bye